A few months ago, my daughter asked me, Mummy, why didn't Jesus have any female disciples? I smiled and said, he did. Her question was understandable. Jesus famously had 12 apostles who were Jewish men chosen to mirror the 12 tribes of Israel. But the 12 were among a much larger group of itinerant disciples who travelled with Jesus and learnt from him. And in that larger group were many women. Luke tells us the names of three of them. Mary Magdalene, Joanna, the wife of Chusa, Herod's household steward, and Susanna. Mary Magdalene has gone on to become by far the most famous of these three. But all three are named as eyewitnesses of Jesus' ministry. And Jesus had other non-itinerant disciples who followed Jesus and stayed where they lived. Mary and Martha are two examples. We hear their stories in both Luke's Gospel and in John's. And in John's Gospel in particular, we see Mary being the disciple that Judas Iscariot ought to have been, as she pours out her lavish love on him and wastes her money honouring Jesus, while Judas Iscariot has been stealing money from Jesus. As Mary worships him and prepares him for burial, Judas is getting ready to sell Jesus out. Did Jesus have female disciples? He absolutely did. And as he said of Mary, wherever the gospel is proclaimed in all the world, their stories are told as well. 